This beautiful plant is goldenrod. It's in the Saladago genus. It's a wonderful, wonderful, amazing medicinal plant. It is a host plant to many different species of pollinators, including this tiny little sleeping bee here. So it attracts pollinators. Uh, it grows native in a lot of parts throughout the U.S. I think its origins are in Europe. From what I understand, most Saladago species have medicinal benefits. The ones found in the Midwest growing wild do. This is a wild uh, variety that grows here in the Midwest. So Saladago or golden rod have an affinity for the lungs and the respiratory system. They can help with seasonal allergies. They're also really rich in antioxidants, flavonoids, and saponins. Um, these are a wonderful um, flower to make a tincture for, for seasonal allergies, or a goldenrod syrup that can help with allergies in the fall. Normally, when ragweed starts to send out um, its pollen spores, that's when goldenrod starts to bloom. So many, thing, many people think that they're allergic to goldenrod when really it's the ragweed that they might be allergic to um, because the goldenrod is blooming when the ragweed is sending out its pollen spores. This is a natural anecdote to ragweed. So if you have a ragweed allergy, you can start drinking goldenrod tea or make a goldenrod syrup or cordial or a tincture to help during allergy season. And like I mentioned, it's also rich in antioxidants, helps fight free radicals from the body. It just has a variety of wonderful medicinal benefits. It is a perennial, a hardy perennial. Uh, you can get native cultivars of this species, or you can plant it from seed and um, or plant it from transplant. But it does grow wild here in the Midwest. Saladago, or goldenrod.